Good afternoon, Jad, Mike at Lakeshore RV. Just getting you a video, like I promised, on the Outback 240 URS. Um, up front here, you have your light on off, power tongue. Retract, extend behind that. Two 30 pound LP tanks. Uh, most campers this size are gonna come with 20s. With Keystone Outback, you do get the 30. Um, up front, fiberglass front cap, docking lights here. This is your cargo door. That there in that box is your 30 amp hookup. Right here we have stabilizer jacks. So extend, fast moving. Next to that, we have your black and gray tank flush. Boring stuff, but closed, open. If you're flushing it, um, you'll want those open, and of course, that open. This is your flush. So you'll hook a hose up to that. That's gonna help clean out your gray and black tanks. Again, obviously that needs to be open. Back into the refrigerator, you do get moisture out of here, totally normal. This would be exhaust, uh, it does get hot. 30 amp supply right here. This is your multi-source signal controller, KTV is what they call it. Hot water heater, your fresh or portable water, your city, your rear stabilizer jacks. Around the back here, I do have the tire drop down and that is so I can show you this storage. Um, it's just a locking pin, so it just folds back up and that locks it in. All right, and get a good look at it with the slide out. I'm not going to put the awning out right now. It's too windy here. we got a crappy day in Michigan. Uh, you can see you have the very nice outdoor speakers. You can mount your television outside. There's your uh, uh, cable and satellite. And there's some plug-ins. Hot, cold, exterior shower. And up front here, we do have... A little bit of storage. Yep, not too much. All right. And into the camper. You got your first bunk. Second bunk is pushed up, but drops down very easily. So you can see that space. And again, I'll open that back up. And then, yes. So, bathroom, porcelain toilet with a foot flush, nice vanity. See how much storage we have underneath here? A little bit. Some more there. And then the vanity, toothpaste, toothbrushes, whatever. And nice size shower. Does have the skylight, so if you're taller, it should work. Okay, close that off. Into the camper. So up front here, uh, your control panel, your water pump. So if you're using your fresh, you want to pump your water. You have your electric water heater, your LP gas water heater. Ceiling lights, awning lights, and your night light. Uh, this here is a tank reader, pretty common. Um, fresh, we'll read empty. Battery, that's my battery. Black, gray. And that just tells you how much is in your tanks. This is your awning. Oh, by the way, uh, about, about 10 feet on that awning is how far it's going to go out. Um, but that controls your awning. Retract, extend, slide out, in, out, really easy. Thermostat, just punch through it. Pretty self explanatory. Look familiar to what you see at home. Okay. Refrigerator, gonna run off of gas or electric. That's your freezer space. Refrigerator space. Nice amount of storage. Outback always does well with storage. Nice drawer, full drawer extensions. Uh, dual ball bearing glides, both nice. 
uh, control panel down there. That's your, I'm sorry, fuse box actually. So if something goes wrong, that's usually a really good place to check. Uh, sofa. This is of course a trifold sofa. So remove the arms, get those out of the way. So then your sofa is now armless. Oops. So, trifold sofa sleeper. And this is a nice, comfy one. Some of them are really cheap. This one's not. Uh, I'm gonna lift that back up. Okay. Hopefully this video doesn't make you sick. It's probably pretty rocky watching it. But I'm doing my best. King size bed in the slide out. And you do have some little bit of wardrobe storage. This one should tell the story of all four because they're all the same. Uh, nice amount of windows also in the camper. And then because this is a smaller guy, here we have the dinette. I do not have the table up. I can put it up, but otherwise, um, Yeah, I suppose you let me know if you want to see that because I'll it'll be weird. I'll have to put the phone down for a minute and all that. So drawers, again, full drawer extensions. And some covered space and a garbage can down there. Um, DVD CD player here. And that's going to uh, link to the TV, which it does come with. Missed that somehow. All right. Above cabinet, your microwave, three burner stove top does fold back over itself. You get the three burners from Furion, and that is your oven space in here. You'll also have a little bit more storage down there. And yeah, so that's that's it, man. That's the camper. So. I'll get this over to you and yeah you let me know what you think Chad and we can move forward thank you sir look forward to speaking with you